New Stitch and Style Fashion Studio from Coolmaker. Your designs from dream to reality. We're going to show you how. Here's what's inside. One Stitch and Style Fashion Studio machine. One sheet of fabric. One thread cartridge. Two clips. One round elastic. One flat elastic. One cardboard ruler. One hydro print sticker sheet. One stamper tool. One threader tool. And an instruction sheet. You need four AA batteries. Slot them in. Now switch it on. Check your thread cartridge. Do not use if the needle is broken or bent. Insert your thread cartridge. Make sure your thread is at least six centimeters or two and a half inches. You can gently pull thread to increase its length. Make sure the button is at pause before beginning. You can store your accessories in the storage compartment. Your stitch and style will go to sleep if unused for 10 minutes. Wake it up by switching it off and on again. Need to cut thread? Pull this cutting tab out. Need to pull fabric out? Raise the foot lifter. Ready to begin? Make sure the stitch and style logo is facing you. Time for our first sewing project. A sunglass case. Spread the fabric sheet upside down on the table. Find the sunglass outline and cut. Place the fabric piece upside down. Fold it along the lines. The clip will hold the fabric in place. Press to pop up the seam guide. It'll help to keep the stitching straight. Align the stitch line on fabric to the stitch guide on the machine. Start with the first side. Hit play and you're ready to begin. Stitch and Style has sensors that detect fabric and sew automatically. Remove clips as they get closer to the needle. Don't push or pull fabric while sewing. It stops by itself when it reaches a half centimeter or quarter inch before the end of the fabric. Now pull the cutting tab back until it locks into place. And cut the thread. Don't cut it at the needle or the stitches will unravel. Raise the foot lifter to release the fabric. Push the cutting tab back in place. Now fold the fabric in half so the pattern is on the inside. Use the clips and stitch. The blue or gray stitch line means stitch on the back side of the fabric. And cut. And stitch again. And cut. Flip the fabric inside out. Hot tip. Use a pencil. And congratulations on sewing your sunglass case. Now customize it. So much more to sew and create. Wet the stamper and gently squeeze off excess water. Select the design area and dab the area with the wet stamper. Choose your hydro print stickers. Peel carefully. Place it on the dampened area and dab some more. Let it dry completely. So cool! Choose your hydro print sticker. You can trim and customize it. Don't touch hydro print stickers when they're wet. They might come off. Mix and match and layer stickers to create unique designs. Looks cool! To keep your seam straight, pop up the seam guide and line up the fabric edge against it. Use sewing clips to keep the fabrics together and remove them when close to the needle. To access the storage drawer, pull straight out and swing slightly to the right. Leave at least two and a half centimeter thread tails at each end. This prevents stitching from unraveling. Pull gently to secure them. To remove the thread, find the last stitch at the end of the stitch line. Insert the hook end of the threader tool through the loop and pull the thread tail out. Then pull on the piece of thread to unravel the stitches. Never pull fabric out from under the needle with the play pause switch in play. First, put it in pause. Then raise the foot lifter and remove it. Your kit has everything you need to make six items. A sunglass case, purse, scrunchie, plushie, clutch wallet, and bandana. More projects on coolmaker.com.